Hey there everyone, in this video I want to show you how to factory reset your HP Pavilion 15. And the model number on this one is 3168NGW or 15-CC067CL. Okay, so I'm going to show you two methods to factory hard reset this laptop. So I'm going to show you first how to do it through the settings, and then I'll show it. I'll show you how to do it with the computer turned off. So in case you have a password and you can't get into it, or if the computer is not booting up correctly, by doing the hard reset, you'll be able to start using it again. Okay, so first off, let's do it here through the settings. You're going to go to the search bar down here, and you're going to type in reset. So this is going to come up right here that says reset this PC. You're going to select that. Here in this menu, uh, reset this PC menu, you're going to select the first option here. Reset this PC. Get started. So here you're going to get two options. We're going to select the second option, remove everything, because we're going to want to clean the computer completely. And then here it's going to ask us what drives do you want to clean. So we're going to select the second option once again. Remove my files and clean the drive. So remember, keep in mind, this is going to erase everything on your computer back to its factory condition. So if you can back up and save anything that you want to keep, go ahead and do that now before you do this because everything will be deleted. Once you're ready, go ahead and hit remove files. And you're going to get to this option right here, which says ready to reset this PC. So once you're ready, you're going to go ahead and hit reset and the reset process will begin. All right. I'm going to show you how to do it the other method now as well. So I'm not going to select reset just yet. Uh, let's go ahead and restart the computer. Okay, so uh, once you're here in this screen uh, and you're trying to log in, so for example, you're putting in the password and it's the wrong password. As you can see, password is incorrect, so it's not letting you log in. So what you're going to do is you're going to press and hold shift key. So press and hold shift key and then you're going to go to the power off menu right here and select restart once again and continue to hold the shift key. So what that's going to do is that it's going to bring us to this screen right here. It says choose an option. Once you see this, you can let go of the shift key. Here we're going to select troubleshoot. And then here we're going to select reset this PC, the first option. Here, we're going to select the second option. Once again, remove everything to fully clean the computer out. All right, and it's going to bring us to this option here. Uh, once again, reset this PC. So here, we're going to select fully clean the drive to fully erase everything on it. All right, so here we go. Here we are at the final step of the reset. So once you're here, you're going to go ahead and hit reset. Once you do that, the reset process will begin. So it's a good thing to make sure that you have it plugged in to your power outlet uh, to make sure that the computer, the battery doesn't die out in the middle of the process. So once you're head ready, go ahead and hit reset and the reset process will begin. As you can see, it says uh, resetting this PC 1%. So I'm going to stop recording and I'll continue once it's closer to 100. All right, so once it gets to 100%, uh, it looks like we got this message right after that. And here we're going to hit F1 to accept. And what that does is it clears the TPM. So it looks like here it's scanning and repairing drive C. So let's wait till that gets to 100%. 
All right, so it's installing Windows now. Uh, it's at 1%, so we're gonna have to wait here till it gets to 100%. All right, so here we are. The uh, the installing Windows part got to 100% now as well, and it automatically will change to this screen after it's done. So here, as you can tell, the factory reset is completely done. It's at the initial setup here of the uh, laptop, where you have to select your country, language, and all the different uh, settings that you prefer. So yeah, this was just a quick video on how to factory hard reset your HP Pavilion 15. All right, everyone, so that's it for this video. If you enjoyed the video or if it helped you out, please give it a like. Remember, leave comments down below on suggestions for future videos. Subscribe to stay tuned for future videos like this. We're gonna be giving away a brand new smartphone of your choice when we get to 100,000 subscribers. And if you're interested in making an extra $1,080 per week from home, working part-time, we're gonna be having a link in the description down below that you can check out. We're gonna have a course that we're gonna be showing you how to be able to do this in the cell phone industry. All right, everyone, so that's it for now, and I'll see you around in the next video. And as always, peace. Ciao.